that uh, I wouldn't consider them friends, but they started making fun of Muslims. Mm. I was like, easy, my man. Two of my best friends are Muslims, Tark and Yosef. Yep. Like, it, it, it doesn't work like that, man. And also, it just shows how uneducated and how, like, yeah, they read the news and you see these, you know, suicide bombers and all stuff going on in Turkey and Istanbul, mm-hmm. all that stuff. And so they generalize, like, easy, my man. You say that around the wrong people. There's a shitload of Muslims. And some of the best people I know are Muslims. They yeah. are such proud people. It's also, it's also, what do you mean by Muslim, too? Does that mean that sometimes you go to mosque or sometimes you read the Quran or you might identify with a general concept of something? You know, you have to be very careful. And if you want to talk about Muslim violence, we could also talk about Christian violence. The last time I checked, 80 million people died in the 20th century because of Christian violence. Wars. I mean, the Nazis were not Muslims. Well, but, but how many Christians has there been with these shooters, like the the Dallas shootings or the you know these mm-hmm. random shootings? Mo- m- most likely, these guys were Christian. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Most. So do we call them Christian extremists? Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Just because you're. Well, they might just be mentally religion. ill, like this guy in Nice who ran everybody 84 people over in a truck. He had a long history of mental illness and, and did he did they yes. say that yes he He's was crazy he was always like he was always a mess and and you know he latched on to this idea of ISIS but this is a crazy him, man yeah. yeah God and damn. same with you know same with uh, the guy the, the Orlando shooter they even though he was talking about ISIS stuff his his girlfriend had been talking about how she thought he was mentally ill for well, a he while beat her yeah. Yeah. So anyway, I mean, yes, I think you're right too. Whenever you categorize anybody, just be careful. Oof, just be, be careful, careful, man. It doesn't, Especially you don't know it doesn't you. help. You know why? It doesn't help solve the problem. It actually, see, when I would say, I said to the psychiatrist one time, I was, that guy fucks with me and I was getting all aggro. And he goes, Ooh, you, you're very comfortable in that energy. And I said, well, you know, that's how I feel. If somebody fucks with me, I'm going to punch him in the face. I was a young guy. And he goes, um, I wasn't that young, but he said, uh, this is last week. yeah, it was. But he said, uh, he said, you know, the problem with that is, I said, what? He goes, it doesn't really work. It doesn't work with men. Cause what they do is if you can get them today, they log it away and they get you later. It just doesn't work in this kind of energy, you know? So mm-hmm. you gotta, it, 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 uh, you got to just be careful. And it, we all have these feelings. I want to, this fucking guy who ripped you off. I want to, you know beat his ass but obviously guess where we doesn't do, make sense you and i are gonna drive down he's like wait the fine kids call tim kennedy the tim kids we need you jump me right now oh god be, yeah man oh god well i, I know well, it was thirteen hundred dollars and you know i mean please i know how to find you guys i know we're just gonna beat you up real quick you mind yeah i mean it's ridiculous. how weird is that yeah the more you have to lose the less you care